beats are one of those things you either love them or you hate them. For me, beats have such an incredible sweet, earthy flavor that I absolutely love them. And I'm going to show you how to make this super easy roasted beet dish with some burrata and pumpkin seed crumble. The first thing you want to do with beets is give them a good wash. Remember, they do grow in the ground, so they have a lot of dirt on them. Once we've given them a good wash, we're going to season them with some olive oil, salt, and black pepper. And it's okay to go a bit heavy on the salt because we're going to peel these skins once they're done roasting. A lot of times when people roast beets, they'll just put it inside of foil. But I like to add some orange juice, some white balsamic vinegar, a little bit of lemon and thyme. That way when it cooks, you kind of get this reduction of this beautiful like glaze that you can finish the beets with and it just adds so much extra flavor. These are Karakara oranges, which I love because they have this really unique kind of like pink hue to them. So it'll look really great playing off the beets and they just have this great sweet tangy flavor that's going to taste super good. So now we'll just add the beets into this beautiful liquid. We'll go ahead and roast these at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about an hour to an hour and a half until the beets are fully tender. While the beets are roasting, let's start on this pumpkin seed crumble. This crumble is gonna give us a lot of texture, but also these really cool little spice notes that are just gonna amplify this flavor. So we're gonna start with a little bit of coconut oil then we're gonna add in our untoasted pumpkin seeds along with coriander seeds, fennel seed, and a bit of chili flake. Finish with a bit of salt. We're gonna to toast these up just so we get a little bit of that fragrance going, a little bit of browning. Then we're gonna grind this up in the mortar and pestle. Now that these are done roasting, we're gonna let them cool a bit before we start to peel them. So with just the towel, we can peel that skin right off. Now that these are peeled, we're just gonna cut the beets into little wedges. So we'll transfer the beets to a bowl, finish the beets with some of that beautiful glaze, and then chill these down. We're gonna cut up some burrata. Burrata, if you don't know, is a mozzarella cheese, a fresh mozzarella cheese that has curds inside with a little bit of heavy cream. So when we cut into this, it's kind of oozy. It gives a really nice creaminess. So we're gonna have the crunchy, the sweet. This is gonna be killer. I saved some of these oranges, so we're gonna cut beautiful segments to add in with the beets at the end. So I cut off the top and bottom, and then use that knife to just kind of peel around the outside. So let's go ahead and plate these up. Start first with your burrata. Add in those beautiful beets. Add a little bit of honey. Add on that beautiful pumpkin seed crumble. Add in some of those gorgeous oranges. Finish with some mint. A little smoked finishing salt. Let's give it a try. This is perfect for like summer by the pool, a grill out, a side dish, a main. This is really, ah. If you like beets like I do, you gotta try this one. If you like this recipe, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, share this one with a friend, and we'll see you on the next one.